Let's look at ionization energies when we're not all atoms. That is, I have chlorine minus, argon, and potassium plus here, a mixture of atoms and ions. Can we deduce which of these will have the lowest ionization energy? Cl minus, argon, potassium. Think about that for a minute and make a selection. Let's look at an argument for each of the answers. Uh, A, chlorine minus, all of these have the same number of electrons, but chlorine has the smallest nuclear charge, so it should have the lowest ionization energy. B, argon is a noble gas and not reactive, so it has a very low ionization energy. Or C, potassium is a metal, which has smaller ionization energies than nonmetals. Think about those three possible arguments and make another selection. We're looking at three species, Cl minus, argon, and potassium plus, trying to determine which will have the lowest ionization energy. Now, interestingly, these three all have 18 electrons. Cl minus, argon, and potassium plus have the same ground state electronic configuration. They're called isoelectronic, same number of electrons. Now, if you have the same number of electrons in the same configuration, and you increase the nuclear charge, that electronic configuration will contract about the nucleus and be harder to ionize. Fewer nuclear charges will allow it to expand and be easier to ionize. So among these three, it's the one with the smallest nuclear charge that's the easiest to ionize, and that's chlorine. Chlorine minus, easier to ionize than argon or potassium plus.